I'm Susie Q. This is Heart 4 News at 9. We have breaking news for you this evening. A blue microorganism identified as Corynebacterium diphtheriae has entered the body. This bacterium causes the disease diphtheria. Although it entered the body three days ago through the nose, symptoms of, of this disease are starting to occur. The body is starting to have a sore throat and a mild fever. It is extremely difficult to swallow at this time, and the lymph glands are swelling to an unusually large size. Let's cut to the capillaries where Hawke was earlier to show you an interview with the UPS truck driver who had a run-in with the disease-causing bacteria. I'm Hawke Lung, here with Quintessa, the UPS truck driver. Quintessa had a run-in with the blue substance earlier today. Quintessa, could you please describe your experience? Oh, hi. Yeah, I, I, was, I, was, I was taking these red blood cells like I do every day, and, and I go through the capillaries into the heart, see? And, and, and I, I went to go in there, and there were these giant blue things. I don't know where they came from, and they were just like, they were going to come and get me. So I didn't know what to do, so I went back to my truck, and I thought, okay, I'm going to drive my truck through the capillaries, so I'm going to just knock those blue things down. So I get into my truck, and I go, and I remember my truck's too big, and it doesn't fit through the capillaries. I told the company last month, I said, you got to get me a smaller truck, I can't fit through there. I do this every day, they go, do they listen? No, they don't listen. Anyway, so I thought, okay, never mind, I can try one more time. So I get out of my truck, and I run through the capillaries, I'm going to deliver these red blood cells, they have to get to the heart today. they got to get there. So I go and take them, and I go, and there's these blue things, and they're jumping up with the legs, and there they are, there they are, see, see Quintessa. And I'm Hawkalung, Heart 4 News. And now to the battlefield in the nose. <laughs> Susie Q. And I'm Hawk Lung. Welcome to Heart 4 News at 9. Yesterday we reported signs of the disease diphtheria. Although our valiant white blood cells tried their hardest to defeat the germ, the bacteria managed to get past them and is now into the heart. Symptoms have increased from yesterday. The body is now drooling, the throat is extremely pained, the nose is leaking bloody watery drainage, and there is a difficulty breathing, a nasty cough, vomiting, chills, and a high fever. If this bacterium is not stopped soon, the body may not live for much longer. Let's go to the battlefield, which is now on the heart. breaking news bulletin. The diphtheria germs have all officially been killed. Welcome to Heart 4 News at 9. I'm Hawke Lung. And I'm Susie Q. Although yesterday was hard on our white blood cells, some amazing reinforcements have come through the mouth. They call themselves penicillin. Also, an injection of antitoxin is coming through a muscle in the leg. Let's see that battle on the heart. <laughs> to build up energy. And now back to Wild Wild West Child. Everything that you receive 
Radio Anima.